so nice to sit here waiting for the sun to set. No problems at all. This is life. This is the life. Hey, what is up guys? Welcome to another video. So, another work day's done. I'm physically tired right now from work, but usually when I do my run after work, it relaxes my body more. Especially when I see um, the, the sky as blue as this, it's so relaxing. So, let's try to make the most out of it. Run! Look at that. Look at that wonderful God's creation right there. Ooh. If that doesn't make you happy at all, I don't know what will. Let's go. I'm kind of lost. I'm in the middle of chaos right now. So this is what's happening in a busy road. Like I'm in a bridge right now. Up there are trains passing by, the train track. Down below, you'd see, uh, you'd see that running track. Also see bikers on this lane, buses, cars going to and fro wherever. Everything's so busy. We also have a little lake down below right there. Ah. All right, so it is the next day and I'm gonna go try to chase the sunset one more time just so I can finish this video up but I kind of I think I lost a lot of energy with with the work today so I'm gonna need some coffee to boost my energy up again before I can start doing what I love to do which is you already know sunset chasing coffee bean I don't really need want to do that uh, let's try something else maybe I can find cheaper coffee station here or whatever just not that let's see but before that I want to show you where we should be going right now uh, All right, so we are gonna go that side of the island. We're gonna ride one of those mini trains, like this one right here from this station. It's gonna take us like around five to 10 minutes max. All right, I'm so glad I decided to wear shorts and my rubber sneakers right here so it doesn't matter if I get wet at all or not. Woo. How was the swim, boy? <laughs> All right, so I literally have to walk on waters just so I can find coffee and start my day. Ah. <laughs> Yeah. 
anybody lost a phone? Am I gonna leave it here? Or I don't know. Whose phone is this? I hear ya. I was actually watching. <laughs> Who owns this? <laughs> so the owner found it. Good job. How dirty that is. So why don't we talk about my love for sunset? I mean, I'm not referring to the sun literally setting, but the feeling that it gets to me every time. It's, you know, every time I see the sunset, I think sunset is God's little way of reminding me that, hey, son, you've done enough job for the day and it's time for you to relax. So it's a constant reminder that all the struggles that we go through every day, they have to end at a certain point. But we have to admit that it's not as easy as waiting for the day to end. We have to walk away towards the end of the road. And as we go along with it, there are a lot of um, obstacles that we need to hurdle 
but one thing is for sure that sun will always be setting that's for sure and sometimes maybe we think that our sun does not set at the time that we we want them to or our problems would end as we wish them to it's not going to be as easy as that because remember that we live in different parts of the world so we have a different timeline so if you're living in the Philippines your sunset would be a specific time like 6 to 7 p.m. but in other parts of the world it sets in a different time of day as well so same is through on the things that we go through in life All right, so just like that, the sun is finally gone and has finally set himself to the darkness. He was engulfed by, by the ocean. So he's gone right now. So let's pack up, let's do what we have to do. You know, you know what's best to do after this? It's time to get some beer. I'm thirsty.